Allow me to introduce you to the art of Ted Harrison. He was born in England in 1926. He moved to Canada and took a teaching position in the Yukon after responding to an ad stating, Come teach in the land of the moose. This is a picture of the Yukon. You can see in his artwork that he loves to paint the same kinds of images with beautiful bright colors and beautiful sunsets just like he would see in the Yukon. In the Yukon, which is in northern Canada near Alaska, you can tell that it is very, very cold. And that's what his artwork shows. You guys have already created an amazing drawing of a polar bear. So now we're going to take that polar bear and add some color using oil pastels in the background. We're going to use Ted Harrison's colorful style as inspiration for our Arctic landscape. So first, you're going to take a black oil pastel and create some wavy, bumpy lines across the background like you see me here. Make sure you do not cover up your polar bear. Now after you do that, you can start adding the color using cool colors. You will remember that cool colors are blue, green, and purple. I also used a little bit of pink to add the moon or the sun, like you would see. As you're adding in your cool colors to make your Arctic landscape very cold and chilly, be sure not to color over your polar bear. You want your polar bear to stay white, just like a polar bear is. And as you're coloring, be sure not to smear the colors you have added. So if you color near your black line, please don't go on top of it because it will smear the black into the color you're using. Otherwise, have a fun, chilly time creating your Ted Harrison polar bear landscape.